What's up, guys? We're back with another episode of Two Short Days, and this one is going to be a little bit kind of weirded out a little bit, I think, but she wanted to go. Um, we went to a haunted property in Tennessee, in Adams, Tennessee, really, really small town. It's called the Bell Witch Cave. Okay, so here's a little bit about the Bell Witch. The Bell Witch or Bell Witch Haunted is a legend from Southern United States folklore centered on the 19th century Bell family of Northwest Robinson County, Tennessee, which is Adams, right? Um, former John Bell Sr. resided with his family alongside, along the Red River in an area currently near the town of Adams. According to the legend from 1817 to 1821, his family and the local uh, area came under attack by mostly invisible entity that was able to speak, affect the physical environment, and shape shift. Some accounts record the spirit also to have been clairvoyant and capable of crossing long distances with superhuman speed. We wanted to check that out. I don't. I mean, I believe in like the spirit world, but I don't know about this. So we we went. I tell you, when you first pull up on the property, it's just. It's in the woods, like it's like a country little town. There's nothing really there. So, I mean, as far as like staying there and different things like that, I don't think you want to, especially if you're, <laughs> I don't think you want to stay there. Uh, she had a little experience in the gift shop. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so from Thursday through Friday, this is for adults up to 13 years old. It's nineteen dollars. Youth from four to twelve is twelve dollars, and for military and seniors, it's seventeen dollars. But from Friday to Sunday, I think we went on Saturday. Yeah, I think it was Saturday. yeah, we went on Saturday for adults. It's twenty three dollars. For youth, it's fifteen, and for military and senior, it is nineteen dollars. Their hours are ten to six. Their last tour ends at five p.m. And they accept Visa and Mastercard and Mastercard. <laughs> like Mastercard? No, it don't. <laughs> it do I don't like know how Mastercard. You do. <laughs> no, it <don't>. whatever. <laughs> um, they have um this thing in October where they're open a little longer until 11 p.m. Um, from only on Saturdays and Sundays, and they do a hunted hayride. So, that part. Uh, also, when you go into the gift shop, you will have to sign your name in. So, this they they mentioned they mentioned along the way. I, I didn't really listen, but she she pays attention to everything. So they mentioned along the way that we signed a waiver in the gift shop. There was there we signed a waiver. I don't remember signing a waiver. The only thing that we did sign was put our name on that ledger in that gift shop. So I'm assuming that that was the waiver. So if you off yourself on this property, you signed your waiver. So <laughs> unalive yourself. I'm just serious. What it is. What? Okay. Oh, oh we have, there are kids there also. Uh, children can go, but due to safety, no children under three is allowed to go because you will have to carry basically you have to carry them through the cave and that's not safe and it's really not it's a little sleep it's a little slippery in there so and you have the duck like really low and there's like little spiky things yeah so yeah you don't, they don't want you or your child to get hurt it's really narrow yes and they also have a night tour for uh two hours for Thirty-five dollars a person for for a minimum of four people, and then they have a three-hour for fifty dollars a person, a minimum of four people. So it's uh yeah, so they turn off all the lights and you get a little more spooky experience. You don't want that. Yep. You don't um, want that. <laughs> as far as food in that area, what we saw was. A barbecue joint. Uh, it'll be in the video. You'll see that. Uh, as far as anything, I re I recommend you probably eat 
something before you go there? Yeah, the nearest towns are going to be Clarksville. Like the large city center is going to be Clarksville and Nashville, which probably from there is probably about 20, 30 minutes each way. So it's like almost in the center, not really. Um, it's closer, I think, to Clarksville than it is to Nashville. Adams is where it is. All right, anyways, we're going into the historic Bell Witch Cave. Uh, apparently, we cannot record, but <clears throat> let's see what we can get. <laughs> she talking about she talking about she gonna be sneaking footage. <laughs> I mean we're gonna both die. Yeah, so we're gonna let you know what we can sneak because we can't record anything. It's and right there saying no it's, cameras. Yeah, it's a sign, so you know. And, look, and the group have already left us, so So that's probably our chance to be like boop. But anyways <sighs> Let's go in here and we will I forgot what I was going to say. Well, hopefully be bad. Yeah. <laughs> See, it's already <laughs> my memory. <laughs> but, all right. See you soon. Being in this cave, like, don't wear your best shoes. Wear some shoes that are, like, you know, you don't really care if they get wet, muddy. Um, I, I had new shoes on. I tried to not get them as muddy or wet as I could, but it's going to happen. Um, it's damp in there. It's cold in there. So bring a light jacket if you know you think going to be cold. You can tell as soon as you walk in, that temp drops. Probably like feels like 60, maybe about 60 degrees or something or 65. It's, it's cold, but not so cold where you shiver like, <laughs> but it's cold. Um, uh, they have boot rentals there too. The uh, rubber boots. They're uh, almost knee high, so you can do that also. But just to save some money, I would just bring some shoes you care less about. We we took a, a trip around the property. We saw a remake of the house. Now, this is not the actual house. Uh, it's it's a replica. Yeah. Is that how everything was set up? They threw a couple little knickknacks in there to give you the feel. But and they have some stuff from the actual house in there. And I, she wanted to touch it, but I was like, "Don't touch that, yeah. please don't." He's like, "Don't touch nothing here." Don't bring it home. Oh, and by the way, they let you know if you take a rock from their property, you won't make it. <laughs> they said they were okay. All right, let me quit. They said that some people who have taken rocks from that property has crashed on the way out. And they mail them back. And they mail them back or they come back and return it. <laughs> return the rock. Yeah, so they have letters in the gift shop of people apologizing for taking rocks. So I, I said if you intentionally take the rock, then it's a problem. But if a rock or like a little pebble get on your shoe, it's not intentional. You're, you're stepping. You Nonetheless, walk. whatever. When you leave, you better check your shoes. I, was, I don't That's know. What everyone was doing. They were checking their I shoes. I thought she was going to honestly take one. Cause she bold like that. I really thought she was gonna take one. I don't, we don't need nothing going on here at the house. Like none of that. <laughs> none of that. None of that. With them, with them, Caucasus was experiences. We don't need none of that here. I'm just gonna tell you. But, so yeah. So I mean, as far as it being haunted. Oh, that little. Mm, this little girl in there. Uh, little girl humming. Yeah, so okay, that part. Uh, there was a little girl on the tour with us. There was only one little girl and her brother. They were probably seven and eight, eight yeah. maybe around that age. Uh, but when, when at the end of, we were walking out of the cave, we were in the, the first cavity of it. They, the little girl and her brother had already gone. exited. They were gone. And there was a sound in there. Now, it was um, us two and three, well, the, the tour four guide. other adults and a yes. tour guide. Yes. So we're all just like taking pictures of the... There's a casket in there of this little girl that they found in the river, which was, uh, and they they wanted to bury her in the cave. It, she's been exhumed. They stole the body, but they want to keep the little grave in as it, intact as it can. So we were taking pictures of that. And, and then we heard this. Yeah, 
Like and we all looked at each other and they were like and, and the two guys was like I think it was a little girl. girl. No, no she's no not in little here. girl was gone. <laughs> it, I mean it's not like it's it, like right there. It's different if it sounded far away, but we all can hear it clearly. And it's not like it was some recording or something. It wouldn't sound like that. It was just a, a faint, just a like 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 a child. Who knows? I who knows? Who knows? But we heard it. I heard it, and and I knew everybody else heard it when they was like, yeah, I heard that too. And they was like, yeah, it must have been little girl. It's like, when you hear stuff that's strange like that, when you see stuff that's strange like that, the mind wants to naturally just theorize it away to something that can be explained. But we did hear something. Don't know what it was. Um, even when we were in the farther end of the cavity, I heard something. Yeah, we all were saying that, well, I heard, me and the little girl, Cause she said it first, cause I was like, mm, I'm keep that to myself. And she's like, it was this noise. It sounded like somebody was humming. humming. Yeah, I heard and it too. And I was like, oh crap. And right? the dude, and yeah. I was like, I have no choice. I agree. I yeah. heard it too. Yeah. I, I just, yeah. yeah. I ain't. I, I won't wanna... say nothing. I want to be weird, right? It, it, was, it was. And then the other guy was like, I thought it was the wind. That cool it, guy was like, there's, there's no, no wind, wind in, in here. here. I was like, and I was like, that was a stupid. Right, he thought it was wind. Like, I mean, I heard that too, but it was, I, I heard it, and she said she heard it, and the little girl was the one that brought it out. She said, I heard da 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 da. I'm like, yeah, I heard that too. So. And the tour guy said something like, it was kind of like doubtful. I'm like, mm, if us three heard it. Heard it, yeah. Yeah, I don't even, I don't even, I mean. Yeah, yeah. he's not even into stuff like that, and psh, you gotta pinch him to believe something. So. And I'm skittish. I mean, I get the fuck on. <laughs> no, me, go check it out. This one, <laughs> this one. She was in the gift shop touching everything. Like I'm like, stop touching that. Why are you touching that? I was like, I'm thirsty. He's like, don't drink. Don't drink nothing here. We're not here. buying nothing here. <laughs> We're going to get it when we leave. Like nothing. But yeah, she like into that. I mean, I'm skeptical. Uh, although I do think that the spirit world exists, I, I've never encountered it, and I don't think. But yeah, I can say, and I have no explanation for it. And I know that little girl was gone out of that cave. Yeah, it was crazy because it was, it was um, when we were walking, we had to go into the cave. He's like, "We're not going first. I'm like, she was ready. Shit, I'm yeah, going yeah, first. she was ready. Like, she was like, like." Like, I'm like, no, no, hold up. Let, let, right, let them go. Like, you've seen the movies, and we were the only on the tour. You already know what's going to happen. If anything's going to happen, it's going to happen to us first. Ain't going to happen to me. And I wasn't going to let it happen to her. She was just ready. She was the first one. Up out of my mouth. I'm like, man, we're not going to this cave first, man. So, the tour guide went in there, whatever. And she was giving a tour. And while she was giving a tour, she was talking. She just stopped and she's just looking. Like, she's like, when, if you ever hear me stop talking, I feel um, a breeze. Uh, uh, or something. She touched her leg. So. Yeah, it was like she said a cold breeze just fell by. And I don't think it's cap. I don't think it's cap. Like, they're looking for stuff too. Like, yeah, they'll tell you. Like, because yeah, a lot of them, like, that's their dream job. Yeah. Like, to, a lot of those people yeah, that work there. Yeah. So, um, I mean, look, you you be the judge of it. I encourage you. Uh, we'll put a link in this video in the comments where you go see more about this cave. I mean, you be the judge. I, I don't know. I'm not going to lie. When I was in there, she was talking here. She said, I was. I sang something and I stared at it the whole time. What? I don't know. What I was, you saw? I was in the cave doing this. See what I'm talking about? What you saw? Like I what? I don't know. I saw her and I felt this. Doing what? That's all in my arm the whole time. So I was like sitting there doing that. I don't know. I just did it. See if I knew that kind of what's going on, man, I would have been like. I'm not saying that. You for real? Yeah. Man, that was going to be the end of that. I, man, you got them cartoons getting out of Dodge. Look around with no spirit. <laughs> something I can't see. What the come on, dude, How you fight something you can't see? Remember that movie? She was like. <laughs> right. What was I that coast that bled. Yeah. Never yeah, in my life. Yeah. Yeah, so, I mean, it's up to you. You go check it out. You be the judge. Um. I'm not interested in stuff like this. This one loves horror movies and scary movies and stuff like that. Not me, but she does. So, what? yeah, I do.
<laughs> that's her thing. So, what? <laughs> but yeah, so I mean, that was it. The hunt, the Bell Witch Cave. Uh, yeah, I encourage you to check that out if you like stuff like that. Um, check it out. I don't think I want to go back. I don't. I, I, I mean, really, I don't even want to really edit this video because I don't want to see no more. I couldn't wait to record this to get this off my phone. Uh, I'm tired of looking at the images. Oh yeah, by the way, we did not mention that you do the cabin first and right. then you do the cave. Right. Because they give you the story. The story at the cabin. Right. And then when you get in the cave, she just talked about it. Oh, also, um, th th there's people that still live on the property. They said it's been owned by various people throughout the years. And there's this old lady that live on the property. She's For 30 years. Yeah, she deaf. And she had a lot of strange activity going on. She kept hearing stuff in her house and stuff. She said the, the night that prior night, night, yeah, the previous night that something had happened that night. Yeah. So, the day we went, so. Yeah, so. You be the judge. Like, I don't know. I don't know. I heard some yes. Do I know what it was? No. Do I care to try to figure out what it was? No. But I heard something. Yeah, not really. Like, for all we care, they can just be convincing us and hyping us up. Like, oh, shit, I felt something. I smell something. I heard something. <laughs> I don't know about all that. <laughs> no, because, like I said, it was like, this whole arm was cold. It attended, my whole body was warm, but this whole arm in there, when she was talking, and when she said she stopped talking because something touched her leg, I was like, zoned up. Why you playing, man? It's not funny. That ain't funny. That's not funny. I can hear that. I can hear that you're terrified in your voice. I'm not. There you are. I'm really not. You get it. Your, your voice get raspy. Get <laughs> it. All right. So that's that. <laughs> You so creepy to close, creeped out to close the video. I mean, um, so of course, <clears throat> leave your comments below what you think and and you know if you believe in stuff like that. Uh, you know, it, it's a very interesting story, but I mean, there's a lot of explanations that can be had, and then there's some things about it uh, or explanation that can be explained, and then there's some things that you just be like, I don't know, I can't explain that. But that's that. So that's our adventure at the Bell Witch Cave. Uh, of course, like, comment, subscribe, and support the show. Uh, be a partner, support the show, because of course we do this stuff on our own dime, and uh, we 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 do it when we can. Um, a lot of times, like work has held us up from doing things that we want to do, but that's gonna change soon, right? Yeah, was about to change. So, so yeah. So that's that. And I guess until next time. Two short ones. Short ones. <laughs> Action. Here's some things about it. She's gonna tell you. Um <laughs> <it's her> phone. <laughs> it ain't funny. Just cause you breaking your phones and you gotta get a new one, don't think I want a new one. Thank you very much. Mm. Anyways. So you wanna tell them? Uh, yeah. Go ahead. Oh, you want me to open it? Oh, that was confused right now. What's up, guys? We're back for another another episode of <laughs> Two Short Two Short Days. Okay, what's up, guys? We're back with another ep yeah. See, and John Bell is the only person who's been um, what they call it uh, killed. Yeah, they they unalived. Uh, <laughs> 
He's the Done only in. one marked as a uh, uh, uh. the mark. He was the mark. <laughs> what you want, John? Damn. Yeah. Like so, that. So he think he thinks that she was a lesbian. I mean, it makes sense. Ooh. You oh the witch? Yeah, you thought the witch. Yeah, <laughs> he she was in love with his John's wife. Well, not really in love. No, she, just, she was. She cared. She got jealous. She didn't want him to, her to marry that's nobody. True. Yeah, right. So. It's a weird ass story. Okay. Yeah. Um, but this is what I think. I personally think that. <laughs> I think that I think it was just black people, slaves. I think it was messing with them. Now there's some things that can be explained with that. But then there's some some things that they claim happened that can't be explained. But nonetheless, we went. And I'm sure you want to know some things about how, you know, what it's like to go there and what it costs and this this and that. But I'm sure y'all heard the notes that she used for this video. Look at that. <laughs> it's hieroglyphics. <laughs> what is this? Read it. What is that? What does it say? God. It's like, he was like, you're reading that. Yeah. Okay, nobody else. That's why I don't have. That's why I gotta get me in.